Hi, this is Mark Shepard from HypnosisAlbany.com, and I'm here to talk a little bit about the difference between thinking about weight loss versus thinking about fitness. We have this whole idea in our culture, you know, that, oh, weight loss, I can't lose weight. But if you think about it, the idea of losing is not, you know, really that appealing. <laughs> if you think about it, it's like, uh, you're losing a part of yourself. It's literally like there's this, this weight, this, you know, heaviness is a part of you and you want to get rid of it. There's like self hate built into it. So I really want to invite you to just shift your thinking for a second here and think about instead of losing weight, think about fitness. Think about optimal health. Think about optimal health and well being. Think about optimal lightness of being in your body. You know, I, I like to use the analogy that our bodies are like spaceships. We are not our bodies. We are spirits who kind of use these bodies to move. You know, it's like if, if you kind of think of, um, you know, some science fiction thing where you can climb into this, you know, this, this mech, this, you know, thing, and, and you can use your body to move this much larger body. And it's kind of really, if you think about it, our bodies are not us. Our bodies are spaceships through which we travel in this world and they have sensors we can sense through our touch. We can sense heat and, and texture and we can smell things, we can taste things, we can see things, we can hear things. And those things, you know, that are really just kind of information channels. And if you think of your body in that sense, that it's really... Uh, I heard a guy on, on the radio talking about his meat suit, you know, uh, it might be a little crude, but if you think about your body as a spaceship, as a vehicle through which you travel the world, you know, if you don't take care of your body, where will you live? I mean, we're living in our bodies right now. I'm thinking thoughts and moving my hands, but that, that comes from my mind. Right? And my body responds to my mind and there's a beautiful interface and connection. But we have to start with self-love. We have to start with appreciating our bodies exactly the way they are. Because even if you're 100 pounds overweight, your body still does amazing things for you. It still can smell and taste and see and hear and, and it still gets you from point A to point B. Um, so we want to really begin with love. We want to begin with be this process of really accepting our bodies and appreciating them. And then when you start focusing on optimal function, on optimal fitness, on feeling good, on optimal health, on optimal well-being, on optimal good feelings and joy, that gives you something to move towards. Because one of the main keys is that we get what we focus on. And if you're focused all the time on what you don't like about yourself and what you you know, if you're focused all the time on the problem, if you're focused on, oh, if I could only lose this weight, then I'd be happy. You know what? You can be happy right now in the body you have. And when you are happy right now, you won't necessarily feel the need to eat to make yourself feel better, right? So once we recognize that there's a connection between how we feel and what we're doing to try to feel good, that opens up some doors and opens up some some pathways in your neurology to get a better result. So that's just one thought for today and I hope it's helpful for you if you're interested in finally getting off the diet roller coaster and getting back to really your optimal physical experience in this world. So if you'd like more information, please feel free to contact me. The information is below. And whether you're watching this video on YouTube or on my website, hypnosisalbany.com, I invite you to learn more and take the next step because it's possible for you to change your life for the better, to improve your life, to create the kind of body that you feel good in. And I talk to people all the time who have gotten off the diet roller coaster and have created a new lifestyle so that they don't have to be on a diet. There's no deprivation here. It's all about optimal experience of life and love and the physical wonder of this body that gets you from point A to point B 
and enables you to experience the world. So thank you so much for watching. My name is Mark Shepard, hypnosisalbany.com. Thanks.